All right, welcome back to the 80 Star Basketball Channel, the only star basketball channel with extremely good looking hosts. These are facts. All right, so um, today is going to be a little scattered, uh, a little. Um, I'm, I'm trying to set up. I have a huge, there's going to be a, a pretty big announcement if I can get to do it. I'm working on it right now, or it's it's kind of flushing out. But um, uh, let's just say that I, I want to wait before it flushes out to be able to speak on it. But it's really, really exciting and cool. I am like little kid shaking to see if this happens. Um, but uh, so I will hopefully have a clarity by Sunday, um, whether that that will be or not. So and I can't wait to share it. But until then, um, I'm just going to leave you uh, and me on the edge of the seats. Um, it, the one thing really quick. So other than that, uh, so I'm kind of actually it's kind of taking up my time this morning. I want to get out this auction action. I want to go over some of the things that have sold. And, you know, obviously, as I normally do and talk auction. But um, today I, I'm really in a limited amount of time, and uh, but I, I did want to go over at least some things and um, talk to some of the main things I'm seeing really quick. So I'm going to condense this and uh, I, uh, you know, try and do as best I can. But if I miss anything, please, like my boss, uh, Kevin, I, Kevin, whatever I miss, throw it out there, you know, put it in, put it in the comments. Um, really quick, I did want to say Dustin, Sports Card Dad, again, my favorite, um, you know, uh, YouTube guy. He he talked about the last couple days. He This morning, he put out a video on, um, you know, the hottest sports cards, and he did talk to the 101. Obviously, this is, uh, you know... Uh, everyone knows this and, and he talks to it a little bit and um, he but he does talk about the centering. The reason why I'd like you to go and see this is he discusses it a little bit and and it's really, really cool. So go test uh, check out Dustin also had a video yesterday that I was going to post up that um, talked about the national and he, he talked about star cards at the end. So he talks about a whole bunch of different things, but um, very, very cool. So go and check that out. So really quickly, I'm going to jump into things that have sold. Um, I'm going to go over, since I did it, uh, we had two sales on. We had a BGS-6 that sold for $16,500, and we also had a PSA-3 for $12,000. Um, really quickly, I'm not usually I'm able to go and look at some of the cards, but today um, I'm only going to talk high level. And the really just high level on these is prices continue to go up in every single category and they are trickling up. Um, and that's what's going on. But the I do have a, a kind of a buy recommendation um, or a, a suggestion. Um, and again, it kind of is if you like these things to make sure that you don't miss out. Remember, I'm I'm not out to, to make money on this. This isn't my mojo. The main thing is I want to get things that I want cheap, <laughs> cheaper, you know, and, and before you get priced out on things, this isn't like pricing out, but I am noticing movement, more movement and a solidified movement in um, Barkley rookies. And uh, especially kind of looking for here, these are continually starting to slowly trickle up. And these nines, I can now say definitively that these are things that are continuing to go and they're going. So I don't know if it's because of, um, you know, the Jeff Wilson kind of pointing one out of Dave's on, um, you know, his video at the National. But definitely, if you're looking to pick these up, if you are waiting, now might be the time to kind of get these before they start getting more expensive because these are clearly going up now. This Akeem is as well, but slower it seems. Akeem kind of jumped and then it, um, it, it's a little sporadic, of course, but for prices that I'm seeing go up, these are definitely moving. Uh, so go and check out those out. Obviously, I think the same thing is going to be happening with Drexler, uh, Dominique, and, um, you know, Stockton. We talked we talk about the uh, Dream Team folks. Um, you know, keep an eye on those. As well as big jumps in 288s, I actually... Um, uh, and the and the 195. This you know things are are this one was kind of odd. It happened um, yesterday. Uh, Three thousand nine hundred for a PSA five. This one was kind of high, I thought, um, but it, it was there. 
and also this 7.5, um, you know, for, uh, for 5,300. So 195s are going up, but 288s are also a PSA six sold for 4,900. And, um, I personally bought, I can tell you the last sale not listed was a PSA five. I bought for 3,750, um, last night. So that's actually what these are, uh, the last sales that I'm aware of. And you can look at a PSA 6 before was 4,400. So again, overall things for the 288, 195. Um, the, I don't have a CK26. There's a whole bunch of cards I would include, but I'm going to kind of move along. But the main um, things I wanted to point out were these Hall of Fame rookies are going up. So keep an eye. Um, so those are those are sales that have happened. Things I want to talk about the 101. Kevin made this really really nice. Um, uh, <laughs> the, the, basically, just a layout of everything that's for sale. Some things that I don't talk to on purpose, and that's one of the things he points out. So he said, "Here's SCP. Here's the 101s for sale." And Robert Edwards, this is so fantastic. My boss does a great job. Um, this was posted in a Facebook group. I don't like to point these out a lot because um, these are they can't be. You know, they're not going to show up as sales, and you don't know if they're going to happen or what the final sale price. So that's one of the reasons why I don't go kind of list things that are coming in forums. And also he added bags um, on here. Down here you can see he shows all the listings and bags. These are great to know, but these are also really hard. There's a reason I don't show these often is because A, they're very condition sensitive kind of things and you don't get a grade. You kind of don't have a sense other than seeing it and looking at it, but you don't know if there's surface issues. Bags are really tough to talk to, so there's a lot of ambiguity there. But of course, it's good to know the info and stuff. So, you know, it's it's always good to see what's for sale. But I want to make sure that when I talk to things, I can at least back it up with data as much as I possibly can. You know, I try and make sure that my decisions aren't emotional when I come in here. There's things that I like. I try and be very, you know, um, vocal with my biases and transparent, but data backs my decisions. It doesn't, I don't go, hey, I really want this to go up and I'm going to report numbers or say numbers that I care about. No, I need you to come here and know, hey, this guy's going to tell it like it is. It's just a spade. And he sees a spade and he doesn't try and turn a spade into anything else. So, um, that's, you know, trying to accomplish that being said, I'm going to show out some of these. He, he puts them up really nice. SC, SCP, eh, Robert Edwards, Golden Heritage. Um, and I'll look at alt for, you know, kind of some of these to sum up, but, um, SCP, uh, we look, we got three days, you know, kind of three and a half days left and we're at 35,000. And then, um, this set, uh, uh with a, a, with a PSA seven in it, obviously this is going to go quite a bit higher, but, um, you know, just some of the ones that you can look at right now, uh, 35,000, I do think that these are going to crack 40. Um, the last private sale that I'm aware of, um, that I can't confirm, but from a, a reliable source was a PSA seven sold for 40. And, um, so that I think that this one is is most likely going to break that. Uh, going in from SCP, um, there are other auctions here for sets, and we have a bag set right here that is at um, thirty seven thousand, and we have a set right here that's graded with one of the nicest sevens, a BGS seven that almost is like a crossover candidate, but just very, very good cards. I think this is going to go strong and this is only at 19,000 right now. So obviously that will jump up, but this seven is really, really nice. You know, take a peek at it and, um, you know, uh, go and look for yourself, but, uh, kind of really, really nice what, what I was looking at. Um, and then going from there, we're going to go check out alt and these are now hovering. There's a, a few that jump up on eBay. Um, some that have come in, like one that was listed this morning in 8.5 for 100,000. That, that six was, I think this is the same one. I'm not sure. I would have to go back and look, but for 23,000. But a couple that added on, obviously, um, you know, uh, prices of these obviously are, are going to be, if, are you going to spend it? You know, they're obviously higher than what they were. So it's hard to, you know, the market's shifting out from all these price increases that aren't stopping. So people are kind of going for the gusto and, you know, it's going to be some time to maybe we see some of these sales materialize. How long? I don't know, but, you know, we'll, we'll find out. 
Um, so this is a uh, kind of what we're seeing. I'm going to cover uh, here's better pricing as I seen is is now Fanatics uh, collect a old PWCC. You know, there's some pricing in here that I would say is more uh, in line and uh, lower. So this BGS eight that's forty two thousand, and then you have this eight five for forty five thousand. Obviously, looking at the subs, you got to go in and look at hey, um, you know. The subs mean everything and condition and whatnot, but I'm just saying this forty five thousand was about um, in line with where it was. So you know, kind of uh, a while ago. So this is this pricing. I would say is is a little bit more um, in line with some of the ones that I see on eBay. Uh, Robert Edwards, let's go ahead and, and take it. Uh, a look at these. These are it. Uh, we have a eight five. That this is one that Dustin kind of shows off. It's got some surface stuff on it. Um, I'm not a fan of this one. Uh, I'll be honest. Uh, you know, it's an eight five, but it's it's got that surface. Um, you know, white paper loss. It looks like it was in a, a screw down and then came off. So be aware. This seven. Um, you know, take a look at it. And um, uh, actually, we'll kind of see on, on zooming in. Uh, not bad, you know, kind of, I would say a normal seven, maybe uh, the centering isn't, um, you know, uh, maybe as good as some other sevens, but this is, this isn't bad at all, you know, so this is definitely, you got to get PSA is, is uh, I, I want to say cross consistency is much stronger. So, you know, zoom in, take a peek at the, the actual card itself and, and things that you're, um, you know, if you're interested in this one, because, uh, you know, this one's at 28 thousand but we we've got a long way to go but not bad and um, we'll see where that you know obviously ends up and golden still has this uh, lower condition set um and uh you know go take a peek at this one as well and so i think i covered ebay so let's go over to ebay and look at some of the ones i'm watching and this is the the crunch some of the stuff i'm just putting up this is a good one so there's a the, it's going to be good to see how the 117 gets priced here's a bgs 9 that's at uh, roughly 2000 right now obviously that's going to go higher we'll see where this ends up but um kind of cool a little bit not not a quad 9 but um i believe this is a an 8.5 um, and then three nine. So, you know, a little bit hair, a little bit lower than a solid nine, but still pretty, pretty solid. But, um, I would expect it to go lower than some of the other nines that I saw just for that, but still pretty good. Um, ones that I'm watching that I want to note here was that PSA six that I said last night for the 288 that sold for 4,905. And um, this was that PSA five that sold for 3,850. So ones to check out. Again, in lieu of time, I'm going to keep this one short. Here's a Gatorade bag for 2800 But I did want to get in some pricing and, you know, let you all know about it. And, um, you know, go and, and go and check out what you're interested in. Let me know if I missed anything. Sorry for the speed. And um, hopefully I will have news for you Sunday. So like, subscribe, and I will see you at the next video.